Hello. My name is Lou Figueroa. Many of you know me as an internet forum warrior. I'm the guy who takes no bullshit from instructors or pro tour players. I have no idea why pros, instructors and basically everyone else on the internet pool forums haven't learned that I really do know everything, I mean, I find myself always trying to justify my in-depth knowledge of everything by constantly listing the elite players who I've encountered in major tournaments, you would think that would give me enough street credit to ram my views in a matter of fact way, or to tell pros to shove it up their broke, illiterate, asses, of course, every so often a pro will feel the need to engage me, but they're drawing dead. But, they don't know just how dead they're really drawing, usually, I just tell them I'm on some exotic beach at some exclusive resort and drinking some cocktail just to make the pro feel like they're broke and not at my level. Ha, these idiot pros. I am, a pro. I must be because I've played all of them. I play in those tournaments in case I beat a good player. If I did, it'd give me something to point at every time I got into a flame war. Like now. I'm barking about a $10,000 set while I'm a $20 a set player, deep down, I'm scared to death because if I lose to John, it's going to blow my pro online persona and elicit the creation of countless knocking cartoons, like this, people might think I'm a knit in wolf's clothing, but I'm really something else. In fact, I'm not really on a tropical beach drinking a Cosmo, when I act like a pro, denigrate other pros or bark about a set that's 500 times the size of my comfort zone, it might seem over the top, but it's calculated, in fact, I know what's going to happen before anyone. As Yosemite Sam once said, before you start a dealing, you best know who you're dealing with, follow me on a tour, a tour of the real story. A tour of. Viper Command. Bear with me folks, we're almost there. I'm about to give you insight as to why I know everything, why I am the commanding officer of Viper Command. This is Camp Delta. This is a proxy command that I've set up to misdirect the locals. Of course. We torture the local Taliban here to extrapolate intel, but, that's also baloney, follow me. Let's take a look inside. We are now inside the command tent. This is where I've given commands to launch tactical strikes into the worst ass pits of the world. Of course, when I'm not ordering our bombers to carpet bomb the range, I kill time by telling my troops how many times I've played at the Derby or US Open, of course. All of this is just a facade. The real deal, lays on the other side of the secret passageway that's hidden behind the gun rack. Welcome to Viper Command. The tour begins with our anti-gravity lobby that was supplied to us by aliens. Stick with me folks, I know this place pretty fucking well. This is Viper Command. This is where the real shit goes down. Forget the Taliban, forget Al Qaeda, forget Democrats. We deal with fucking aliens here, son. Get it? I was chosen to run Viper Command because of my ability to negotiate with extraterrestrial intelligences. Namely, because I'm so smart. Plain pool is cake compared to aliens. The map behind me shows real time info on abductions. Of course, Abductions that I myself have authorized. Okay, let's move on. This is a portal to the lower level of S4. S4 is a special sector of Area 51. S4 serves as the Foreign Technology Division of Viper Command. Here, we reverse engineer flying saucers, anti gravity propulsion systems, and center to edge. We found that the saucer's anti gravity system uses element 115 during a nuclear reaction that converts heat energy to electrical energy with 100% efficiency. Of course, that breaks every law in thermodynamics. 
but I didn't write those laws. If I did, they would coincide with our findings, of course. Hey Albert, have you had any luck figuring out how the Hell Center to Edge works? We know more about sending soldiers to our moon base than how the hell it makes every shot. I have no fucking idea. I pivot one way and the ball goes in. I pivot the other way and the ball banks in. It's tripping me out man. Well, keep working on it. I'll keep knocking system users and instructors on AZ billiards until we know what's going on. Excellent. Good to see Planet X is maintaining orbit. Some people call it Nibiru, but they are idiots. So that concludes our tour of Viper Command. The next time you think I don't know what time it is, or that I'm over the top in my claims, just remember, I am. Viper Command Oh my god! I must have had a bad dream. Let's see if John Barden replied to my post yet. Now I have to clear my browser cache to make sure my wife doesn't read about if my bed. If she finds out about me playing in a $10,000 set, she'll take my laptop away. She doesn't know that, I am. Viper Command, baby.